<clears throat> Today we're gonna do the oil change for uh, uh, Honda Pilot 2013. So this video is for beginners, uh, for first timers. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. And the first thing is to remove the oil cap. So right there and then I'm gonna go down there to to remove the drain plug okay so down here we're gonna remove this drain plug right here and we're gonna use uh, 17 millimeters Number 17 wrench. To lose the drain plug. Okay. Here's our container. Okay, so we can wait around five minutes to to drain all the oil. So I'll be back. All right, so now it's like five minutes. So now put it back. So now we're gonna remove the filter that is right there. So I'm gonna use this uh, filter wrench. Okay, 
So now our filter is here. So we have to clean this area here. Okay. a little bit of oil on the gasket clean the oil here and it's ready to add the oil okay so so we're gonna use a zero w20 and so we're gonna use a pent oil full synthetic and here's our uh, funnel so make sure it's really clean inside so well, right now we're gonna just add four quarts and so we're gonna add five uh, four quarts for now So, check it, take the funnel out, and we'll put the old cap on again, so we're going to start the car for about about 10 seconds but I'm gonna put it down uh, of the ramps so. So we'll run it for 10 seconds, 15 seconds. Good. All right. 
So now we want to check the, the the oil level. So we clean the the dipstick. The dipstick is right here, right there. So. So as you can see, it's here, so it should be in this line right here. So it needs, I guess, like half, half quart. So we remove and we're going to add Half Okay, I think it's good now Check the level again Okay, so as you can see, it's right here. So, so it's it's good to go. And the other thing is, uh, this uh, full synthetic uh, says that it's around ten thousand miles to do the change. But I recommend to do it every like 5,000 miles or if you want to do it like 10,000 miles like every oil change just keep checking the oil level because uh, sometimes the oil level goes down and it's Hondas or Toyotas if you have one and when you when you reach the 10,000 miles just change the oil again but in the meantime, you can just keep checking your oil levels. So, alright guys, thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys and I see you next time.